When we start to sense our loved ones in spirit, we get a little bit overwhelmed and we may shut down because it's just so much for us. But if you start to just focus on a little bit of their energy at a time, you're gonna have this amazing, wonderful, vivid image. What we do in my mentorship program when we're doing practice readings is we start by feeling the energy of the spirit that's there and then we'll look at their feet. We'll look for at the bottom of where their energy is emanating from and then we'll start with the feet and we'll describe the shoes and what do they look like. Then we'll go up to you know the legs. Are they wearing shorts? Do they have pants? What do they look like? Are they old? Are they worn? Are they new? Are they work pants? Are they fresh? Are they clean? What? Is, and then we'll go up a little bit more. Are they wearing a belt? What's going on in the belt? Do you just give their hands in their pockets? Go up a little bit more. What kind of shirt do they have on? They have this kind of shirt. What kind of dress? What kind of, what is it? What color is it? What's it made out of? What are there any patterns on it? And then we'll go up a little bit more. What does the face look like? Are there any predominant facial features? Are they wearing glasses? Do they have a hat? Do they have any, any facial features that stand out? What's their facial expression? And then we go into mannerisms. What are they doing? How are they carrying themselves? Are they excited to be here? Are they more shy and reserved? Are they standing still and stiff? Or are they kind of loose and just moving around? And that's where we start the reading because if you're new to this and you just go right into it, you're gonna get overwhelmed. But when you start and you just go little piece by little piece and allowing your awareness to continually expand, you're gonna get it. You're gonna get it. It's very easy when we take that framework and apply it.